<laughs> That's a hard one. I'm so versatile, it had to be more than one set. <laughs> the 8094 control center from 1990, that was the first programmable Lego set. Or the 8480 space shuttle, the high-tech set with fiber optics. Or the 8421 mobile crane from 2005, which got me back from the dark ages and back into, into playing with Lego again. And of course the 8275 motorized bulldozer, the set with remote control that first got me thinking about better controls uh, for the Lego power functions. I guess if I have to name one set then 31313 Mindstorms is a pretty good fit for me. I think Roni would be the 8880 supercar. In that era it was built with quite basic pieces. But the resulting model is so much larger than the sum of its parts. And just like that said, he's full of functionality. And I think still now that set is a benchmark for the following sets, especially the supercars. As for Ronnie, without a doubt, uh, 3131 3, all in one. Uh, the robot that uh, talks, walks and thinks, uh, always in the move, extremely smart and full of new ideas and most of all engineer that knows his stuff. His persistence and passion made all this possible. Hmm, uh, I think I would be the Volvo concept reloader, the, I think it's 42081 Zeux set. I think because it's such a such an unusual model, I think it's like just like the set, I'm also like trying new things and you know trying to solve the problems from kind of a different angle. And I think that the camera and drone would be really practical, you know, for building and recording stuff when I'm doing that. And like at the end of the day, I can just use the big shovel to clean my desk. He would be a 17101 Lego Boost Creative Toolbox. These are problem solver uh, from the beginning. Every good team must have one toolbox like the M8 is. He's the 42115 Lamborghini Sienna. He's smart, powerful and full of technology. He never runs out of ideas for new models and he's capable of designing and building even the most complex models in record time. So I would probably be um, Lego 42100. Not so pretty, but uh, strong and persistent. My job since uh, 2017 is to introduce movies to the people around the world and convince potential customers to buy. Feedback that uh, we are getting from a uh, satisfied customer makes that job much, much easier. I think the Tifumir's closest set would be the new uh, Dom's uh, Dodge Charger. I think it's 42111. And it's because, like, just like that original car, he's a, he has a quite a quite an imposing presence with the stylish aesthetics. And just like the real car, he's very powerful when it comes to conveying the message about movies and what they do. And he has a very large social presence. And he's not afraid of burning rubber when needed. And I think currently he already used like five sets of tires, something like that. Well, I think Tihomir is the 42055 bucket wheel excavator. He is big and loud, but also very versatile. He knows how to throw his weight around. When he starts hunting, when he starts digging, he gets things done. 